What's up, everybody? My name's Tony, and welcome back to some more Resident Evil 2. So, last time I had to go get another one of these electronic parts in order to get the key card to get out the parking space or the parking lot, whatever. But off screen, I also managed to run around the map a little bit more, and I was able to get all the items partially. There's still some areas I missed, but I got majority of them. I could have sworn I went to the secret room too. Oh well. So most of the items I've already gotten. Um, there's something in here that I can look for, but I'm gonna worry about later about that later. So now I'm gonna go install this other electric part, so I can get this key card and get the hell out of here. Let's see. Where are you? There you are. Oops. Hmm. Those two. What? What the hell? So these two have to be connected. What? Okay, okay, um... This one has two directions. I got one piece? I don't, I don't understand this. There we go. That was somewhat confusing. Isn't that the police chief? Also, I apologize, but I'm a little bit sick. In the neighborhood, you'll find it. Sherry, all right? For now. I swear, you bastard, if you hurt her. So damn dramatic. Stupid. 
just hadn't dropped that fucking thing I could let you go. Don't worry, Sherry. It'll be all over soon. That's the phrase they say before they kill you. There has to be a way out of here. <clears throat> oh, what? Oh shit, I'm a child. Oh god. Who gave you such a thing? I think it's terrifying to look at. If I get to play as a child, okay, that's probably my way out. Nope, there's a block that could go there. Hold on. I want to kind of explore this room a little bit if I can. Nope, I guess I can't. Like, is there another block or something? Or do I even have to come back here with Claire? I don't know, but it's not giving me anything, so I'm gonna just leave. Uh-oh. There was a block. I almost, I always forget to examine things. <clears throat> Weathered looking old block. So that goes here. Oh. Uh, okay, this has to be a circle. Square. Triangle. Okay, this one goes at the end. There. Was that supposed to... That's not it? Oh. Okay. I see how it is. One with two triangles at the top. No, not one with two triangles. What am I talking about? That's not it. Star at the bottom, triangle at the top. So this is it. Circle and you know, square at the top, triangle at the bottom. That's not it. Square, star. What? Triangle, square, no. <sighs> Two stars. That's not it. Okay, that one does not go there. God damn these puzzles. So I need a star and a square. That's it. Cir circle star. No, not like that. Okay. Triangle square. Thank you. Scissors. Oh God, these puzzles. Anyways, like I was saying earlier, I am a little bit sick. It's starting to creep up on me, so I apologize if I start having a coughing fit. <clears throat> what is this? This is not the time to be asking questions. This is the time to be leaving. Is there anything else I can steal? Medication. Medication. Nope. Okay, this room was completely empty. Run, child! I just... Okay, that, that door was closed. So this must be the orphanage that they were talking about in Leon's story. Wednesdays are perfectly great days because we get snacks and ice cream. 
I hate the last place I was at. The teachers were all meanies. It was just study, 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 and there was there wasn't no ice cream. I love, love, love it here. There was an important rule to made today. Everyone must write a diary, get health checkups, and we aren't allowed outside by ourselves. It's good we don't have to go to school. I don't want to go and get picked on for my old clothes, especially not by the guy that used to wear them. The orphanage director is coming today, so I'm going to go wear my favorite checkered blue outfit. The director is tall. The director has a mustache. The director is a policeman. Because there was Chief Iron. But what were they doing with the children here? Danger. No. Nope. Clemming? I can't read that. So what were they doing with the children in the orphanage? Were they experimenting on them? Okay, this is the nursery room. I think they're here for me to grab. This is unsettling. I don't like how they have this here. Is this the right way? Yeah, this is the right way. Flower, happy, pink dog. Alright, so I just need to go down the stairs. Ugh. Why is this so terrifying? It's because I'm playing as a child in this situation. Like, I have no way of protecting- the door out of here. Child, don't do that. I have no way of protecting myself in this situation. And it's like, it's unsettling. I need guns. Like, there's zombies about. My phone just, vi just vibrated. It wouldn't give me this hallway unless I couldn't go through the front door. Tom's diary. It's been two months since I sent that letter to Oliver and all I've gotten back is not a zip. Then again, they're all like that once they get adopted. Bet he's living like a king in some fancy folks home and forgot all about us. Really thought Oliver was different, that he'd be my friend for life. Guess I'm just a fool. Anne set all the little kids down and told them a story today. She said all the kids that get adopted are turned into food for the boogeymen. That's why no one hears from them ever again. Not sure where she gets her ideas from, but she's sure... She's sure got the mind for writing trashy horror novels. There's something weird going around, going on around here, and it's not just because of Anne's stories. Don't get me wrong, I've been in worse places, and this place is funded by some big drug company, Umbrella. But why can't we? Uh, why can't we call people to go outside? Why are there so many doctors around? What's with these shots every day? It's almost like we're. I'm getting adopted. Me. Most people go for the younger kids, so I figured I was too old, but I can't say I'm not a little happy. Who am I kidding? I'm totally psyched. I say goodbye to this place on the 20th. I'm going to try my best to be a good son, someone my new mom and pop can be proud of. Oliver came back in the middle of the night, all messed up screaming, help me and stuff. I didn't even recognize him at first. His face was all peeling and melting off. He's with the teachers and doctors now. It's just a skin thing, they say. He'll get better soon, and then we can go on adventures together again. So Umbrella Corp was using t um, students, I mean, not students, children as test subjects. Of course, I need a key. I, want, I, need the key. I know you need the key. But I'm curious, as like, in Leon's storyline, once you get to, like, the G-Virus stuff, Okay, but Leon's in the Leon's like the little notes by the G virus. Oh no, it's him. I swear to God, if he comes to that fucking door.
He's right there. He's somewhere. I don't know where the fuck he is. All I know is he's somewhere. Can I use his typewriter? Hold on, let me read this. If you're reading this, go call police. Police. Boogeyman's here eating everybody. Many bark boogeyman's here. Helk, they're coming. Helk me, mommy. Okay, so that's when the zombie outbreak must have started. God, this is... So they were experimenting on children, and I'm assuming that they were using the G-Virus on these children. Because in Leon's side, when we get too close to the end, there were notes saying that some of the test subjects remembered themselves, but they still died. Oh. Where the fudge is that key? This is not the time for puzzles. Oh my god. Give me one of these tools. I'll bust my way out of here if I have to. Who the fuck is this lady? Where the fuck is this damn key? Yes, child. Did you have enough sense to grab the key? Oh. Did you grab the key? I guess not. Oh, God. Little girl, will you shut the hell up? You stupid bitch, that's a dead end. I hate this. How the hell am I supposed to get this key? Oh God. Oh God. Look, if you don't shut the hell up.
You are trapped. Oh my god. How the fuck am I supposed to get the key? So I basically have to wing my way around this shit. This is stressful. Honestly, I'd rather deal with zombies than deal with this shit. It's all over now. Doors locked. Yes, we've been through this already. Where are you? I'm dead. Show yourself. I know you're in here. The longer it takes me to find you, the worse it's gonna be. Little girl, shut the hell up. Bitch has got to be here somewhere. God damn it. Well, I'm stuck here. You, I ain't coming out. Oh, oh, it burns. <sighs> now, get the key. Shut the fuck up and get the damn key. Does that mean I just run for it? Like, I don't understand. Son of a bitch. Where the fuck is my key? I see you. Go, bitch, go! Go, bitch, go! Go! The fuck are you standing there for? Ooh. You ain't hurrying fast enough. What's up? Are you kidding me? Nice try, Sherry. <laughs> this is bullshit. Where am I going? Where am I going? Yes, lock the door. Oh God. Why does he have an axe? Bitch. Go, go, bitch, go! You didn't think to lock that fucking door? come from 30 minutes earlier why are we jumping back and forth in time here we've got unfinished business what are you talking about don't waste my fucking time bring me the pendant or sherry dies the pendant what do you need it for do you want the girl to die fine where are you? The orphanage. The orphanage? Where is that? In the neighborhood. 
You'll find it. Sherry, all right? For now. I swear, you bastard, if you hurt her. Are you serious? As the plague, apparently. <clears throat> Damn it. Parking garage key card. Ugh, this rescue Sherry. Praise the Lord. Got everything I need. Let's get the fuck out of here. God, that was fucking ridiculous. Let me save. Ugh, so stressful. Why? Why is that a thing to play as a child in this game? Anyways, let's go. Let's go uh, get the hell out of here and go save this child. Still a lot of time for this playthrough of Resident Evil 2. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.